What's going on, everybody? My name is Austin. You're back, Burger Fight Gaming. We're here once again with um, Smilakra. Who's a birthday present? <laughs> I'm not sending you nudes. It's a joke. Take it easy. What'd you have to? Uh, not much. Just chilling. Don't believe me if I told you. My jack up. Try to find me some person. What? Wait? This is a prank. Am I on live stream or something? Kinda, yeah. Not on live stream, but, you know. I'm done. Bye. Put it for negative attitude. <laughs> Looking for. Oh, shit. Hello? This is Detective Marillo from the police department. Hi. We have strong evidence to suggest that you are holding on to a missing person's phone. Yes. We also have reason to believe that you are working with an accomplice named Greg Summers. Yes. Conspiring to keep Anna's disappearance a secret. Yes. This is an obstruction of justice. Okay. And I'm afraid I will have to bring you and Greg in for questioning. Okay. Please. A woman's life is at stake here. Find me. We are reasonable. If you can assist us with the investigation, there will be no charges. Call me back if you change your mind. I've been trying to call people. They don't want to call me back. What if I can't call them back? See, like, like that? Okay. Okay, so now I need to figure out how the hell to get a hold of... Uh, his work, which is a problem in itself. Found it. Okay. Email that way. Okay. 
and a email and a at gmail dot com copywriter yay that'll work oh, actually, I actually didn't look is there a way to call them no there wasn't so. yeah they'll email me Talk to Taylor about James's behavior. Have I not done that? You stop your shit. You people suck so much cock. Fa la 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 la. Okay. Okay. Uh, find out more about James through his workplace, which is what I'm trying to do. Call mom. Signal error. I'm still waiting on an email. Oh, it's not correct. Oh, you sack of bullshit. <sighs> okay, I'll try again. There we go. That should be right. Dum dum. Dum dum. Dum 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 dum. Anyway. Ah, uh, email cmail dot web. Dot web. Dot web. And uh, at cmail dot weeb and uh, position got 
the right tur. Oh, there we go. Dirt, ah, nah. Okay, start interview. Fill. Howdy there. Hi. This is Anna. Yes, this is me. Neato. I'm Phil. From Fresh Ideas. Or Phil the Fresh, as some of my buds call me. Get it? Feel fresh? Feel a little fresh? Uh, is he ready? Mm, can I ask the question since they had. Oh, that was worse, bud. You can ask questions a little later. Okie dokie. I got it. Coolio. Five years from now, what do you see yourself doing, eh? Your mom. <laughs> um, get to the point where I can tell other people what to do. Slow down, bud. I'll be careful when I use the word tell people what to do. Next question. Why should I hire you? Uh, I've learned stuff which might bring unique value. We don't know what those stuff are. Last question. Why do you want to work here? James Alder spoke highly of you guys. Do you know him? James? I haven't heard that name in a while. I'm sorry, bud. Don't call me Bud again. Bud. Oh, shit. So I won't repeat his mistakes? That's kind of the thing we're looking for. It's a shame, really. We had to let him go because of his unprofessional behavior. Is he a criminal? Oh, God, no. As far as I know, at least. To be frank, I'm not the liberty to discuss any personal matters. All I can say socially, he was one of our best. He gets along with people well and generally likable, but kind of changed. What changed? He broke off with his girlfriend, and of course he was upset, but he is still himself until he got spark. Since then, he's been showing up late, he grew distant. Then one day he just finished. He didn't show up for work? My eyes might be deceiving me, but I was so sure of what I saw. He went into the bathroom for quite some time. Then I heard a strange noise coming from it. I even recorded it. Listen. Same one from Anna's apartment. Did you contact him since? We tried. Since then, he never showed up for work. No phone calls, no emails, nothing. So we terminated him. Plus, our big project didn't come. Well, our big project coming up, we didn't really need it right now. That is weird. So he isn't the first disappearance. And is the second. We found his phone on his desk. We tried checking it, but I think it's broken because it kept glitching out. Some say they still see him on Jabber. Some female friends even saw him on Spark. Whatever happened to that kid, I think he needs our he needs help. Professional help. That's all I need. Whoa, sorry, I went off on a tangent there. Thanks for the interview. We'll call you if you get the position. Call his workplace. Well, texted. Fresh ideas, isn't it? What have you got for me? James went missing as well. No way. This kind of confirms what I found as well. Sick cat. Calling for ideas is a great plan. I think we got some great leads. Okay, you show me yours. Now let me show you mine. I found something about James too. What the fake mask we do not want you to know about the recent experience of dating apps. First of all, I don't want... 
I want to commend the local news coverage of escalating this horrible trend to the whole new level. Just when I thought they couldn't sink any lower, they did. Downplaying the seriousness of this issue and treating all the victims as just another statistic to be forgotten. Blaming these crimes on trivial things such as the rise of the internet and the degradation of our youth. This has to be stopped. This is more to the story. And all the people deserve to know the truth. I do not want you, my readers, to continue being brainwashed by the mainstream fake media. Lucky for you readers, I have the scoop. I was working with a local detective, a very trusted friend who I can't reveal his name to keep him safe. Seems any connections to the crimes, and oh boy, was the rabbit hole deeper than Bill Gates' wallet. But why am I doing this? Because there's something strange going on with Spark. These big tech corporations are slowly taking over the world, selling our photos to government spies on us, and now paying off the media and law enforcement to silence our voices and further pass files and submission. Okay. Hmm. 22 year old student, those books. 24 year old waiters studying for a law program on the other side. With your own marketing intern, dreams of writing your own novel. This is still developing, but I don't have too much info about him. Here's what I can dig up. He's 25 and he works as a copywriter. Although he's technically missing, he is somehow still active on Jabber, so no one's filed a report yet. But it didn't stop here. His phone was found in someone's backyard and handed to the police as evidence. This is where it gets weird. I know a guy who knows a guy who's gone through his phone. They found a weird video of him on huge chunks of data missing. I'm still trying to get a hold of it. Oh, okay. I read it. Right. Okay, I need to record this so we are on the same page. So, um, commencing epic monologue. Anna went missing the same way as James. They were both last seen going on a date with someone on Spark. Right. Anna and James still had activity on Jabber, but no one has physically seen them. Right. It's the same pattern. James is still nowhere to be found. Right. I hope Anna doesn't share the same fate. You're right. There's too many similarities between Anna and James for it to be a coincidence. Whatever that's happening right now is spooky as fuck. There's a poster going around making people disappear and I think he or she's assuming that they need James. We gotta find him and I think I know how. Let's hear it. You've had some good ideas so far. Let me just take something real quick. I'll get back to you. Okay, meanwhile, I wanna go see what the hell this was about. Oh. God damn it, I'm hitting dead ends everywhere. Should've stuck with us. You should've stuck with me. No. I'm f I would set up following Mr. Perv like a dog. Mr. Perb has some good ideas. Whoops. Buddy, pal, friend. You know I have nothing to do with Anna disappearing, right? Right. You know what they do to guys like me in jail? Mm -hmm. Oh, I sure as hell don't want to find out. Look, if anyone asks, you gotta back me up. I was just saying it would be good for you to go to them if... For... Evidence, you know, like going to jail is not an option for me. You won't go into jail. Fuck Anna. Fuck this shit. I'm leaving this to you. Run, Greg, run. Uh, all right, all right. Hey, 
You Bugs Bunny fan? What's that? It's an old cartoon rap from the 80s. Right. There are plenty of episodes where he will dress up like a girl and lures enemies into traps. Classic. I see where this is going and I don't like it. You're thinking what I'm thinking. We need to lure his creep out. Like Bugs Bunny. Bait him? Yes. Big Cash says Apostle aka James in the act is some creep learning victims on Spark. He could beat him in his own game. <coughs> I think you're right. a good idea. No, I don't. <laughs> we can get the debate on this later. We are so close. Yeah, go to Anna's Park profile and start creating. Alright, it has been saved. I don't know how it's going to be until I hit another save point, so I'm going to go ahead and pause it real quick. Come back to it here in a bit. So, as always, like the video, please like, subscribe, and suggestions, gameplay tips, comments, look, put in the comment section below. I'll see you all next video.